Okay, so I'm going to give out this software. This is something I've been working on for a while now. It's got some stuff wrong with it. It's not all the way uh, as good as it should be or could be, but this version I'm just going to go ahead and give it out. Um, once you get it downloaded, I'll show you what you'll be getting. So in this folder, we're going to run the rocksforgolf.exe file. Now, what this is going to be is every time you hit a ball, it will record that swing and it'll play it over for you a set amount of times. There's no way to go back and pull up one um, that you've already hit, so that's one thing that kind of still needs fixed with it, but if you're wanting to be able to see your swing on automatic repeat after every swing, this will do that for you. So we're gonna open this up, and this will automatically find your cameras. Let's search for the cameras. Okay, so it found my two cameras. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to change the record time for me. This is going to be different for everybody. Um, playback speed, you can pick how fast you want the videos to play back. The display delay is how long of a delay is going to be on the screen. So like right now on the bottom left, that is live. If I move over here to the camera, you'll see there's a delay. Now I'm over there at the camera. So there's about a two second delay, which is what you want. Um, replay delay will be how long it takes before the replay plays after you hit the ball depending on what you're doing you may want that to be a little bit longer or less and then replay count I normally put this at three or four because sometimes the first one or the second one gets a little goofy and it'll kind of stutter and then at the bottom you get to pick which dis which display that you have connected to that you want your images to show up on I think mine's on display two is what I wanted on for this so if this doesn't work on this one I'll have to switch it so you because you won't see the replay um, right here you click this button for audio input that's going to use your microphone and then how volume um, the, oh, there's a spelling error there the volume will be for to activate the recording so the lower this is the louder the noise the higher it is the less louder so again turn this on Okay, there's the automatic playbacks. And they're just gonna automatically repeat as many times as I told them told them it to. And then I'm gonna change the speed down on this next one. Swing looks like crap. Oh, a lot of stuff I want to change there. And that'll just automatically replay, 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 and then it'll just close itself out. And now you're back up to do it again. Mm, that hurt. My swing's all messed up. Anyway, so that is the free software. So take it, enjoy it. Hopefully it works for you. Um, it does need to improve. Like I said, there's things that it might crash on you a couple times, but hopefully not.